cannot replace the come my love. <laughs> I love you, Arthur Morgan. I love you. Arthur has an opportunity to score a Black Arabian as early as Chapter 2 if he's willing to put in a little work. Here he is with the Black Arabian and the Piebald Tobiano Hungarian Halfbred. You can find the Tobiano at random NPC camps. Arthur found this one in Scarlet Meadows, very close to Clemens Point. Here is your location, just north of Clemens Point on the shore. I ain't got no business with you. Just minding my own business. I'll knock you silly. Yeah. Now let's take that Hungarian to Saint Denis and get ourselves a Black Arabian. We are looking for a robbery event that happens after midnight. It is a random encounter that spawns all over the city, but I have had a lot of luck at this location on the street between the I and the N of Saint Denis. I will show you how I trigger this event in real time. Note that this is not a glitch, this is a scripted encounter, it's built into the game. We are a little late. I like to do this around midnight and it's after 2 in the morning. We're going to ride up and down until we hear a conversation about dishes. It's okay, girl. Look, I'm not being unreasonable. You're better than me. We cannot replace the come, my love. Here we go. This couple is about to be robbed. We can stop the robbery or let it proceed. That's not important. What is important is that this couple has a female black Arabian. Arthur stops the robbery murder before it happens like he's in Minority Report, and now we can go for the horse. Which just got knocked down by this runaway coach. That's new, but no harm done. We gain honor by stopping the robbery and lose it for stealing the horse. It's a zero-sum event. But hey, free Black Arabian. And the good news is this time we didn't catch a bounty so no lawmen are chasing us. That's very convenient.
Now we need to get both horses to the Van Horn stable. Normally I would just haul out of there and trust the Hungarian to follow at her own pace, but I need her to follow closer so we can do a comparison, which slows our exit considerably. But then again, nobody's chasing us, so time isn't really an issue, and we need the daylight for the video. So, all in all, this is the best case scenario. And here we are outside the stable. Just look at those two black beauties. Besides the obvious size differences, we can easily see the Hungarian's heavier, more solid physique juxtaposed against the Arabian's clean, elegant lines. And look at the forehead slopes here. It's almost a straight line with the Hungarian, and you have this gentle curve with the Arabian. It's very aesthetically pleasing. I mean, all horses are pretty, but Arabians are arguably prettier. Arthur is just going to walk around for a little bit and admire these two horses and pose for the thumbnail. Easy, girl. You're okay. Yeah, good girl. This video is sponsored by Batman Tonio, my second gaming channel where we play every other video game that isn't Red Dead Redemption 2. Like and subscribe for longer format deep dive gaming commentaries where I overanalyze and focus on the details. And from the front we can see the Arabian's tiny diamond blaze, one of the smallest blazes in the game. I do like the piebald's black and white coat and it looks like she has a bay highlight on the tip of her nose, at least in this light. And it also looks like these horses are getting along just fine. 
And look at those Hungarians' massive hooves. Wow. Yep, yep. At level 4, the Black Arabian comes in at an impressive 9 health and 9 stamina. The Piebald Topiano at level 4 is at 7 health and 6 stamina. If you ain't got the papers, I can't give you the full price. I really think your horse will appreciate it. And I really like the contrasting mane and tail for the black and white Arabians. I'm convinced horses love that. That piebald is indeed one of my favorite horses, easily in my top five. You can't beat her for bravery and general fortitude, outstanding at both hunting and missions. Whereas the Black Arabian is just pretty much outstanding at going fast and looking pretty. However, stats only tell half the story. You also have to pay attention to how the horse makes you feel. And the Arabians, temperamental divas as they are, are the fastest and most attractive horses in the game. They know it, and they will never let you forget it. I'm Super Antonio. Thanks for watching. I appreciate your views. Like, comment, share, and subscribe, and hit that notification bell for daily Red Dead Redemption 2 content, and we shall meet again. Further on down the trail. Yeah, you're all right, girl. Fine! Damn you, tree! Sulky, angry, scarface. A right barrel of laughs.